Well, they're my two end pieces. They're good and square. I had a choice on one here on the top. I had uh, either square it with the boards going up and down or squaring it with a logo. I chose the boards, so it's setting square with the boards. The logo's a little off. Um, but you can see it made quite a bit of difference in here. If the logo's a little crooked, it's a little crooked. Main thing, the boards on both of them are now parallel and they'll fit in well. All I gotta do is screw it on my base now. <coughs> and I think I'll glue them together before I screw them down. Yeah, I just glued it together. I don't have any big fancy wood clamping machine. I bought a couple cheap things from Harbor Freight. And uh, just put it on here and clamped it. I think it's uh, probably pretty good. It's close enough. All the cracks are out of it. Again, I'm not trying to make wine. I'm just trying to make a trunk out of it. This is a lot better than it was. Now I'll cut this one, or knock this one apart, and glue it. Yeah, first one dried a bit. I uh, glued this one down. What I did on the first one, I clamped the, the back to the, to the smooth surface of the board. And uh, really... That wasn't necessary. I should have clamped the front down because that's the good part. And so while this one's drying, I'll I'll screw this one down onto my floorboard. And uh, I'll try to put it all together and put pressure on it uh, before that glue completely dries. Now my line here is where the inner edge of the barrel goes. So I just took my drill and drilled some some holes in it a little bigger than, than the screws. So I'm not going to be putting a lot of effort into the board. I'll be putting all the screw into the into the end. This one's on. It's not quite a square. I need to pull it in a little bit here. To get it square but uh, once I put the barrel on it that should pull it all together and now I'll just get the other one it should be pretty dry but now it's over there and I'll put it on and then put the top of the barrel on it's all screwed down good and tight put uh, plenty of screws in it I'll put it back up on there and uh, do the same thing with the barrel. Well, that took some doing, but I got it in, got it on. I've got it screwed down pretty good here, and I think glued halfway decently. I'm gonna pour some more in it here and let it sit upside down so it'll get into that crack and seal it well. But uh, it's pretty good. Got my last stave in where I can cut it off square there. And uh, I'll go up flush. I've got one more bottom piece that goes in here. That'll, uh, Clean it up pretty good. If that's in right. Uh, it probably goes like this. It's marked with a yeah. That's the way it goes. But that'll go in here. And that'll clean up my bottom pretty good. I only need a little bit of that one, but that's enough to cover up the. Cover up the floorboard of it, and uh, I think 
couple more wood pieces across the bottom like I did before. I'll just set this thing up here. And we can see that uh, one wood piece across the bottom there. That'll make it look really good from the back. beautifully and then the bumpers I know what I'll do then started fooling around with my other barrel piece here uh, see what we got in the way of seats uh, it looks pretty good I'm gonna cut it in half and sort of set it in there and see what I got I whacked them up stuck them in there Looks like we got some potential. Need to obviously do a lot of work on them, but uh, if I take them right to the edge of the door, they'll look pretty good. And uh, I think I can put one piece in like this. Kind of clean that up. Maybe a few more along the top. I'll lay some pieces in here and see what it looks like. Well, pulling around with them there. It looks like uh, there's a good chance that I can cut up some of the stuff and make myself a glove box right in the middle. Uh, it doesn't look too bad. One more thing I thought about here. I've got a I'm going to put some kind of a roof on this thing and this would be a pretty good uh, deal to do in here. The other thing I thought about was I've got some room in here that needs to be covered up. Uh, and I can use this wood for that. I don't have to these are cut barrels length, but uh, it would be pretty easy to cut this stuff up into square stuff so they'll fit in there nice and tight. Uh, and that will match all the rest of this and I could screw them right here on the bottom of this, this doohickey here. So, I don't know, I've got a lot of wood left. And uh, the barrel's going to kind of set the theme of the thing. I'll just keep playing with it. Sooner or later, I'll figure out something. Anyway, that's about it for today. I'm going to flip this around, glue the other side, call it quits.